time people uh, remember my beans I was growing and it didn't want to grow well if you check here let me see if I could do this because the lighting is so bad if you see this look how big it's growing it has a lot of space because I took the you see it there I took the um, the trellis that I made and I put it here since it's not growing over there I'm gonna take them out of there start putting them in here I'm gonna take these out because they gave me a couple of these things that you hang up. So I'm going to take the cilantros and put them in one canister. I took the... I cut, let me see if you could see it there. Ah, I don't know if you could see it. <laughs> but um, I took the strawberries and put them back up here again. Because they were growing better when they were up there. I don't know if it's the lighting or what. I'm going to also take this out and also you um, put more beans in here. So it's growing pretty beautiful. <laughs> I guess that's what I needed was a little bit of lighting. And I got some more for you. Okay, so this is my squash. Um, here in Puerto Rico, we use a lot of these um, gates. Every Most of all houses have these gates. It keeps criminals away. You feel more safer, you know, and everything like that. So it's locked. Most of the time, you know, you could leave the door open. The kids could play in the balcony. And they're safe. So, I'm using this. I'm putting this in my, how you call it, my gate. You know, it has these things. These um, chicken thing. I forgot what they call it. It's a chicken thing, anyway. So, um, how you call it. I put these here. If you could see, I don't know if, yeah, you could see it. Because I see it here. You can see the roots, how fast it's growing. I put this in, in a couple of days, it was all the way down here. It's already close to the end part, so I already added this part. I'm going to keep going down until it gets to the floor. I don't think it's going to get that big, that long, but I noticed that it loves it here. You know, it's nice and beautiful. It's all nice and green. And you were wondering, okay, so when it grows big and it has its fruit, what the heck are you going to do with it? I'm going to tie it up. That's why this is there. I um, If you see here, it has another one. I could just let it hold on to here. You know, and just mess around with there. And if it grows and it needs some holding, it will be, you know, the fruit. It will be easy for me to, you know, tie it up. So, because it's at a level for my wheelchair and me, you know. So, you know, this is a nice thing. I also have another thing to show you. And I'll be right back. Okay, here we got, we have, always correcting myself, we have a cherry tomato. You remember it was real small when I first started showing this cherry tomato. And it hasn't grown too much because I keep cutting it. Right here I cut it, you know, one time. And it's here. So these, these plastic um, cups are great. Because you could tell if they're growing or not. You, you're going to see the uh, roots in the bottom. That's how I got to my how you call it, pepper plant. I cut a piece the top of the pepper plant. And I buried it in one of these. Just thinking. I wonder if it will grow. And it's growing. It's in my raised bed. So that's great. Plus I got both of them. The one I cut is already has a pepper. And not that one I cut. The other one. The big one has the pepper. And the other one, the small one, is growing. So now I'm thinking that, you know, uh, I got to be careful because it has, it's starting to have strawberries, uh, cherries, cherry tomatoes. So I'm planning to cut this other side also because I want to give one to my cousin and one to my daughter-in-law. So this one is for one of them. I don't know for who, which one of both of them. But I want to show you that too. Okay, so now I'm going to show you my other tomato. Look how big it is. This one's going to get cut off too. <laughs> okay, I plan to cut it around here. Because I don't want the plants to grow big. I like the way uh, Ray says about cutting them and it gets stronger. It's true. I did that with my... Ah, I got to show my avocado. <laughs> I did that with my avocado and it is beautiful. So I'm going to show you that in just a second. You want to see also my plantain? Look at that. 
and pretty soon you're gonna see more down the road <laughs> because uh, my son buried a whole bunch of them so we're gonna have a lot of plantain we got bananas down there I don't know if you can see them we got bananas down there I got some more bananas on the side of the house so we're doing pretty good <laughs> so let me show you my avocado okay this is my avocado look how nice it already got some stem coming right out it's gonna have it has this one that's one two three four five six so far that i see ah seven i just touched one seven avocados that is gonna come out ain't that great um stems that is gonna come out i'm gonna see if i could grow this more but with fruits that's what i want with fruit this is a a good um plant uh seed it came from one of the uh, best avocados around the area you know it throws like in one stem it throws it could throw up to 40 42 avocados i got this from my cousin and i'm very happy with it so um i hope you, you enjoyed the video and because i didn't have to make none this week i don't know what happened but i'm gonna uh, see if i could make one before monday because after monday is gonna be harder because i take care of my granddaughter so let's see what happens i'll see if i could shoot some more videos before the day is over okay bye